This is the Let's go. He stepped back. He stepped back. Welcome to the mob. Welcome to the mob. A lot of people told us that we wouldn't give up. Now we living life like it ain't no tomorrow, baby. Welcome to the mob. Oh, so, welcome back to the Double B Mob channel, man. Today we back with some UFC reactions. Y'all seem to enjoy the last one we recently put up, so. You know, we, we love, you know, we love all sports. So any sports reactions y'all want us to react to, let us know. But today we are here with the worst injuries in, 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 in MMA history. Uh, oh, so this not even exclusive UFC. I don't think so, because that, that don't look like UFC. But, uh... Yeah, that looks like a circle. That's not an octagon. Yeah. Yeah, um, we have had the unfortunate pleasure to see a couple of injuries uh, that we've watched <laughs> live performances on. We was watching, uh, who's fight was that? It was Uriah Hall versus Quip, Chris uh, Weidman. And Chris, that nigga stepped back, bro. Oh, my God. Chris Weidman. <clears throat> Chris Weidman's leg snapped. We recently watched the Connor uh, versus. Um, we also saw the drill when when Cuzzo kicked uh uh your uh, ball head cuz. You saw him when he kicked his leg and his leg right. You saw him. What who the fuck is that nigga name? Man? You saw him. That's a tight end for the Bengals. What's his name, bro? Ball head. Ball head. The, 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 There's only a few. He's well, African. Man. He's African. He's a champion right now. He's talking. To, he's a talking to time. He's a talking to time. In Ghana, I guess so. But he's not bald headed. And what did he break? And he's the he champion. didn't break he anything. Break but the dude was fighting him. He kicked his leg, and his leg broke. Do you not see that? Oh my god! god. In the last reaction? No, never, never mind. It's not. It's not going. Through. It's not going through. Yeah, right now. The only two I remember was the white guys. Right, Connor and Chris. I remember Connor. I remember Connor shit. He was trying to fight on it for a little bit. The dude, and then the dude before that, it, it was the start he of the fight. Step back, and then it was the start of the fight. The dude kicked. He kicked his leg. His leg was so fucking strong that his fucking leg snapped. But you want he, Addison Silver? Never mind. Never mind. Never mind. Never mind. Just oh. carry on there, please, 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 okay, please, right. please. Right, you mad at us? No. It's not getting through your head, so I'm not gonna continue talking, and it's not it's not going through your mind. Well, they, they'll know, they'll know, they'll tell us. But um, real quick before we get started, what's the worst pain that that y'all have ever felt? Uh, a physically, a cramp. <laughs> That's it. That's the worst pain you ever. Bro, felt? I have not hurt anything on my body, bro. I God forbid, I don't. I hope I don't have no toys here or nothing. I hope I don't get none of that. Right, I've been like taking, I've been taking yeah. care. <laughs> I, I got from that one. Only thing I, I probably get, I just twisted my ankle. But I don't even think that's even a fucking that shit was funny. <laughs> I something <just> went down. <laughs> so you trying to stay up? <laughs> that shit stay broke up. his ass down. <laughs> <laughs> you know, you know the city, bro. You know the city had the, uh, they got the little trees on the sidewalks, mm -hmm. and they got the wood chips, and they got that little fence around it and shit. Mm -hmm. Oh, didn't see the fence. I came <laughs> down from the fucking Amazon truck and my New Balance. Oh, I and I, I didn't want to embarrass myself. <laughs> <laughs> So I try to save myself, and it, it didn't work. I still fail, and I fucking hurt myself. And then so, you take my advice for that, bro. The same day, I rolled my ankle. The same day. I remember. I remember that totally. I was like, it's my first fucking day, nigga. Uh, but nigga, I fell. I was in the apartment building. <laughs> I was coming from the third floor. Uh, I took that last step to the second. I just said, well, I said, oh no, I'm falling, nigga. I'm not fucking yeah. that shit up. But. <laughs> The worst? <laughs> Imagine hearing that in y'all. <laughs> like, we heard that. Like, it would have been like right here. Uh, like, bro, that shit was crazy, bro. Nobody told me. Uh, somebody, ooh, somebody sent me through their peephole. 
That's what I'm saying. Like, cause it was crazy. Like, I was on all fours type shit. Like, <laughs> a genie, like, I can't find my glasses. Like, I fell to my knees, bro. <laughs> I was watching. Bro, I know they laughed the my fuck, ass bro? out. Bro. I know they laughed my ass out because that was the time I didn't even have. I had my hoodie on, but my hoodie was y'all fucking with me and shit, so my crock potty was out. So I was. <laughs> No, I probably just folded. Nah, the worst part. Hey, old time though, old time though. I'm, I'm kind of I'm glad that actually happened though. I'm kind of glad that actually happened. Why? Because it just, it teaches me something new. I know now the, the, the just I'm, I'm, just fall, I'm just falling. Uh, but the worst pain, I mean, I've broken my thumb. That didn't really hurt. Right. Because when I did that, I was, it was at football practice. And I was doing a running back cone drill. I put uh, like you put your hand down, you went around the cone. Mm. I I didn't have cleats at the time. Oh no, I never did this thing. I fucking slipped and fell, mm. but it shit, it felt like I jammed it, so I got up and fed the drill. I got back to the line, my shit was my shit was Look. But it was a bit more than this. Mm. So they had to numb it and then put it back, but that wasn't the worst. The worst was when I, I was playing, I was hooping at school. For trade school on lunch break, mm-hmm. big ass dude fucking took me out of the sky, bro. And fucking, I'm going for a layup. Mm. Nigga took me out of the sky. I, I like I try to catch myself. I said just fail. Try to catch myself. Mm. Put my foot down. This one was still in the air. This jump rolled over. So I'm a big guy. So all my weight on that roll ankle. Mm-hmm. So then. Like I said, I was in trade school, so now I'm taking the shuttle back home. The shuttle is stops at the metro down the street from my house. You used to know where the metro is. I had to walk that whole, well, I was about to, I was trying to, but when I got off that bus, that shit was biting, nigga. I had to catch an Uber. I had somebody call me an Uber. So. No, but I think the worst pain is wisdom, too. Yeah, I was about to say, bro. The that is the fucking A. I've ever, I ever oh, felt is, is toothaches, bro. You haven't got your witness suit for yet? Huh? You haven't got your witness suit for yet? Oh, no. No. My wisdom tooth. I don't tooth. think I have either. No, but mine didn't hurt me. My wisdom tooth was baby and shit. My shit was crazy. You got a pool? It was. No see, way. Let me see. Let me see what, what side is on. Oh, it was this side. Elementary school. I was in DC. That's the time I was doing my. Yo, was the two came in elementary school, bro? Jesus, Christ. they pulled that shit up, bro. I had, it's, I could have nothing aluminum, nothing, nothing. It, it was hurting, bro. My whole side of my face was swollen. I, I remember back. I wore my, I wore a hoodie that, that, like for two weeks straight. A hoodie on my head. I remember the teacher tried to tell me to take my hoodie off. Uh, I got, I got mad. I got in trouble. I told it off. I don't want to take my fucking hoodie off. My fucking cheek was fucking swollen. No, I don't want to take my hoodie off. So I got in trouble. I'm never supposed to. But my father, talk, my father talked to the lady and like, you know what I'm saying? Like he just got his, he, you know, he got a situation going on. She said, I don't know. But they let me pass. It's crazy, bro. Out of everything, I done fucked up on my body. Two dates. It's crazy, bro. Yeah, Out of all the bo- bones and you shit, can't do, bro, because it's, all- it's nothing you can do. Nothing you can do. You're at the mercy <laughs> of that, <laughs> bro. bro I pray I don't. I, I pray nothing spin the block on me. Oh, because oh because when, because like you know you you chomp down the jump and they take the screenshot of your sides. Mm. When she took a picture of it, like I mean my my mouth has hurt before, you know, you know what I'm saying. Mm. But it ain't like to what y'all talking about. But like when she took a picture of it, it was like it was small as shit because the wisdom tooth supposed to be big, right? I don't know. Yeah, but that joint was small, and it and I never had to like, hey doc, you gotta pull this shit out. My yeah. mom had, I seen my mom go through. I seen like how you said your face was swollen. Yeah, I, I seen your mom face, and I think she got. I don't think she did. She get a take. It was even her or somebody else, and they was like eating soup and shit. Couldn't eat nothing. Yeah, I take. I take. I, I, I fucked up a lot of shit. My fucking finger. You just said you didn't. Well, I had surgery on my finger. I, I, well, hold on. We 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 gonna yeah, surgery we on your finger. That's why I bite my nails and I was outside playing a lot and it got affected. We'll we'll, we'll spin the block. <laughs> let's let's get to let's get to the video. You know what we need to start doing? 
We need to we need to start putting the video stops at this time. If you don't want to hear us talk. People do it. People do it for us. I, I, you're, you're right. Yeah, we should do that. I should so we, can I you should. do like some time? I do do a yo, you know what I'm saying? Woo, woo, woo. Put the video and then we can just have a talk on there. Bye. Um, well, I, you know what? I'll start, I'll start clapping again because I would have to sit through the whole oh. video and find oh. when we start. Oh, yeah. I, I, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, so, yeah. For, so for videos like this, when we rap it for 20 minutes, I got to listen to the whole thing and then find when we start. And then hey, Drew. I just gotta stop. Hey, Drew. That's what that is. Can we? Can we? I don't think I'm asking for a license. I was gonna say we should put a tally up on who's gonna look away from. That's a good one. That's a good one. Uh, well, well, let's, let's get to it. Y'all ready? Yes. Strong. Oh, I got the. I got the joint. Oh no. It is no secret that the sport of MMA is one of the most dangerous sports in the world. In this video, we will be taking a look at some of the worst injuries sustained inside the octagon. This list will contain some of the worst eye pokes in history, fighters refusing to tap, body parts hanging on by a thread, and just plain old freak accidents that no oh. one could see coming. Before That's we begin the list, be warned that this video is not for the squirmish. The first injury on the list is Joanna Jandersik's forehead hematoma. She went up against Wei Lei Zhang at UFC 248 for the UFC strawweight title. This was a highly anticipated fight, with Joanna being the former champion and credited with creating the strawweight division against Wei Lei, who at the time was on a rampage through the division. Oh the fight my god! Up to the hype, with the two going to war with each other for the full 25 minutes. In the third round, Waitley landed a solid right hand on Joanna's forehead that gave her a hematoma. By the beginning of the fourth round, everyone, including the commentary team and audience, had noticed Joanna's forehead. As the fight continued, Joanna took more damage on the forehead, which led to it growing oh. even more. By the end of the fight, the hematoma oh had become massive, leaving Joanna recognizable. recognizable the fight was incredibly close, That's with it being able bro. to go either way. The judges gave the win to Wele via split decision. Like, that was and my girl. Right, you might get the fight with the night right, bonus. Cat. For the next couple of days, Yawada claimed to have lost vision in her left eye, but was thankfully able to make a full recovery within the week. No. The second oh, item on the list is. is Anderson Silva's leg snap during his bout. Ah! Before his first fight against Weidman, Silva oh, was on a 16 fight winning streak within the UFC, with 11 of those being title defenses. He was a big favorite coming into his first fight against Weidman and was showboating throughout the fight. Unfortunately for Silva, he paid the price and was knocked out. Oh, in their is... rematch five months later at UFC 168, Weidman gets off to a good start with an early takedown and throws heavy hands. Silva stayed busy doing damage from the bottom position. In the second round, Silva throws a leg kick that was checked by Weidman. Oh. <laughs> Ref instantly stopped the fight. Mm. There was controversy surrounding the fact that Weidman was celebrating his win while Silva was on the ground oh. in agonizing pain. Weidman did later show his respect after he realized the extent of the injury. Silva had to undergo surgery to insert a titanium rod to repair his leg. Oh. After a year of recovery, Silva was able to enter the octagon and continue with his fighting career. Coincidentally, oh, this is why the exact boy. same injury eight years later at UFC 261 yeah, against the Hall. Saw. Weidman's leg kick was checked by Hall oh, and snapped in half, causing the fight to be oh, stopped. That's the one this I said. Hall being the first that's the one he stepped back. He stepped back. Jesus Christ, bro. He is not expected to fight for at least another year. Next up, we have this Alistair Bigfoot. Overeem's this is crazy. That's Bigfoot, on eh? December 19th, yeah. 2019. Overeem what went up do? against Johnson and Rosenstrike in a main event. Okay. The fight begins with the two being very cautious. Overeem was able to get a takedown and from there remained in complete control until the end of the round. Round two began with a lot of fighting from the clinch position. After three minutes in the clinch, the ref called for a reset in position. The two continued to be cautious, with Overeem seemingly to have a slight edge in significant strikes. In round three, Overeem gets a nice takedown and starts to ground and pound from there. Entering the first main event round, Rosenstrike comes forward with a barrage of strikes. 
He seems to be slightly more aggressive in this round compared to previously. The fight stays on the feet for the fifth and final round. Overeem appeared to be the more dominant fighter overall and was set to take the win via decision. But in the final five seconds of the fight, Rosenstrike lands a clean right hand that drops Overeem, giving him the win via KO. Overeem <laughs> back up and that's when we see his lip hanging off his face. This was one of the worst cuts in UFC history. But fortunately, Overeem underwent plastic surgery and his lip healed back quite nicely with only minimal scar. Bro. Overeem claims that the fight was stopped too early. Imagine going home that night trying to eat something. He was able to get right back up. Fuck, can he give you Come fucking food? Just feel it, bro. Just feel this part, bro. Next, we have this three-minute breaking Tim Sanders. I got this big ass This was gone. This was gone. This was gone. This was gone. The vacant heavyweight title. That shit would have been crazy. This one shows the importance of high-level refereeing, especially when the stakes are high. Herb. The fight begins with Silva taking Mir down to the ground. From here, Mir was quick to lock in an arm oh, and snap Silva's arm. Oh, happy attack! Protested the stoppage and claimed his arm was not broken and even got the go ahead from the doctor. The crowds were booing, but upon the replays, Joe Rogan was able to spot the moment the arm popped. Hence, oh. why Mir was awarded the win via TKO. Since then, Sylvia had screws placed into his arm to assist in recovery. Screws. It was later revealed by Herb Dean that he actually thanked him for the stoppage, claiming that he saved his career. Recently, he has posted to social media right, stating that the screws in his arm from 16 years ago have become loose and resulted in a nasty infection. His partner has since set up a GoFundMe page to help pay for the medical expenses. If you would like to donate to the page, the link will be in the description. The oh, sixth on. item on this no, list is the worst on, eye white, man. You in gotta UFC history. For that man this was a good, scheduled man. main event between Bilal oh, Muhammad and against it. Leon no. Edwards. He didn't pay for it. The fight starts with Edwards saying he needs to kick followed by a flurry of punches. Oh, yeah. He then pokes Muhammad's eye and gets a warning from the ref. The fight continues in the Bro, round. I can't have it the <laughs> <eye again. laughs> This time, it was much more severe, with Muhammad wailing in pain and exclaiming that he can't see. With his eye all swollen, the fight was ruled in no contest. Fortunately, Muhammad later posted that he had not suffered any permanent damage and will be looking to run it back with Edwards. Despite the fight being labeled as a no contest, Edwards stated that he is no longer interested in the rematch and instead looking for the title shot. Dana White has also posted an image of the eye poke to his Twitter account. This incident has sparked the old debate on the need of better designed MMA gloves to reduce eye poke accidents. Next up, we have Leslie Why Smith against Jessica I is. at UFC 180. Right off the bat, Jessica comes out of the and appears to be much faster than Leslie. So. Towards the end of the fight round, she lands a shot onto Leslie's cauliflower ear. Oh, oh she, 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 that that bitch ear. she continues to dominate Leslie, and we see oh, blood everywhere. Oh, while they are attending her. The fight continues in the Oh, game. she's still banging that motherfucker. She's still hitting it, bro. Bro, I would have been. Hey, hey listen to me. Literally tear off at any second. The fight was called off. Bro, I would have been throwing all right hooks, bro. You got to stop this. She later claims was because she couldn't feel any pain in her ear. But upon seeing the replays, completely understands why the fight was stopped. Backstage, the doctor took one hour to stitch up her ear. And she has since been medically cleared to fight in the octagon again. The final fight we have on this list is John Jones versus Jail Sonnen at UFC 159. Huh? Both fighters were coaches on the Ultimate Fighter show. This resulted in many fans publicly criticizing the UFC for allowing Sonnen to fight for the light heavyweight title after just losing to Anderson Silva for the middleweight title. Leading up to the bout, there was a lot of trash talk in typical Jail Sonnen fashion, creating a lot of tension between the two. The fight starts off with Jones initiating a clinch and getting the takedown. Sonnen manages to get back to his feet and to be taken right back down things. moments later. John never lost. From there, Jones lands heavy elbows and punches and takes the win via TKO. It was only until the post-fight interview with Joe Rogan had he realized his toe was broken and bloodied up. Oh! It was unclear the exact moment that dislocated his toe, but believed to be because of an awkward position before oh! <laughs> 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 That concludes the list for the worst injuries in UFC history. It would. Oh <coughs> my God, bro! His toe—that shit just gave out on him, bro. Came off. How hard was he walking? <laughs> How you 
walk so high, you bust your toe oh, off, bro. Like, no, I'm not, 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 i am not 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 I, bro, I, I didn't know what happened. I, I never saw nothing happen in that fight, bro. I, but I never watched the post fight interview. Right, you probably like, all right, that's over. Yeah. Like, do what I'm doing. Right. Oh my God. Okay. The I, skin. I, I, I know it was hard to look at it, but out of that whole video, what, what was the worst one? To me, I say the ear. The ear was the worst one. Like, comment, Jesus subscribe. Christ. Appreciate y'all for watching. Till next time. Welcome to the mob. A lot of people told us that we wouldn't get five. Now we living.